Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, and today I'm going to be playing this story again, so let's get started. So yeah, I'm going to be playing the Bowie story again to make some more stories. The reason why I'm whispering is because my um, family is sleeping, so yeah. Alright, so these are all the characters you have to be. These are all the speed. Oh, what happened to my character? Um, okay, it's fine. <coughs> this is the teacher, Emma, Claire, Emily, uh, Amara's mom, Amara, Angelo, Thad, Caleb, and Caleb's mom. So let's see the story. Ma okay, now, right now, Amara is 11 years old. Girl, since birth. Okay, so Amara was born 11 years old, but she was deaf. Bye, sweetie. Have a have a great first day of school, says in sign language. Oh, sign language. Bye, mama, says in sign language. What does sign language mean? I don't understand, but school okay amara was so excited she loved to meet her here but this year it was hard for her hi i want to be friends i'm new says in sign language are you hello are you date all right wait hey are you new oh hello. are you deep uh, you're answering us Wait. Oh, never mind. Hey, um, hey, are you new? Hello, are you Deepy? Why are you not answering? Hi, I want to be friends. I'm new. Oh, <laughs> uh, because I see numbers there. So, guys, it looks. OMG, guys, she has a sign language. She is S. She's I S. D. So that means she, so that means we can't tease her without even her knowing. She looks really sad and knowing. <coughs> oh no, oh wait. The other laughed long. Amara was confused. It looks like they were laughing at her. Oh no, I think they're laughing at me. Is it my clothes? I told my mom, Papa, I wouldn't, wouldn't like it. <laughs> Go away, deep girl. You don't want to be friends with someone who can't hear or talk. It's pointless. Well, she can't hear, so. I'll kick you. Come on. Hi, class. It was class time. Amara had no one to sit with. I want to sit next to her. Where is Amara? Oh. Okay, class, today we have a new student with us. Today, Ma Amara. <coughs> Points. Why is everyone staring at me? Wasn't I supposed to have a special teacher to help me? Oh, that's rude. So today we'll be working in part to excuse the importance of the government. Okay, this is really serious. Emily, you will be with Emma. Yes, yes. Angelo, you'll be with Claire. No, please, no. I don't know. That weirdo. Caleb, you be with Amara. Hi, Amara. I'm Caleb. So do, you, so do you like this school so far? <coughs> Amara points to her ear. He realized what she means and give her a note.
right? I don't know. I don't think I have good friends in yet. Okay, let me go close. Bro, this is just a bunch of scribbles. I'm not stupid. Right. Oh, do you want to be friends? Amara answers on the back of the of that paper and continues to communicate that way. Can you stop adding scribbles? It's just the same thing. Yeah, sure. Amara writes down. It was lunch time. Amara sat with Kayla and his other friend, Angelo, inside. Hi, Kayla and Angelo. Is this a new girl? Who is this girl? <laughs> what? It was lunch time. Amara sat with Kayla and Nicole. Yep, her name is Amara. Who's then? She can't hear her, though. She's deaf. Oh my god, what's that sound? Anyway. Waves back. Waves. What? Sag? Sag waves to Amara. Amara. Amara waves to Sag. Who's a. Ooh, what's wave? Oh, wave. Hey, Amara, I bet you're dumb because you can't hear anything. Haha, <laughs> I know. How are you supposed to learn without any hearing? Stupid dumb girl. <coughs> Stop making fun of her. It's not funny. Shut up, of you. Uh, shut up. I mind your own business, nosy. No, stop being in front of her. She's kind and a friendly person. Wait. Relax, Caleb. She can't even hear us. Stupid weirdo. Oh, I forgot. Yeah. What the heck? Why is there so much chips on the table? So weird. They're looking, and they're explaining. That's good doesn't mean you can't take advantage of her, of her hearing loss, so you guys can make fun of her. <coughs> oh, um, yes, it does lose her. Let's go. The nerds are getting so pressed over, over stuff that she doesn't even understand. I know, right? Let's go, girls. Walks away. Oh, that was sad. Oh, whatever. Amara is in class with two of her new friends. She writes something on a piece of paper. <coughs> what happened? I let you guys seem angry. She writes and passes the note to them both. Wait, who's that other friend? Oh, that's her? Yeah. Right. They were trying to make fun of, the, of your loss, so we stood up for you. Wait, 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 what did you say before? What happened at lunch? You guys seem angry. Oh. They were making fun of your hearing loss, so we stood up for you. Oh. Yeah, but don't worry. Bullies, bullies make fun of others so, just so they can feel better about themselves. Sag washes the note back to Amara. Amara writes back to the new piece of paper. Oh, dang. But thank you for sending up for a dog. The guy's just the greatest dog I ever had. Oh my gosh. So weird. Hmm. Sag and Kayla read the notes. They smile. Let me do Obby. Oh, okay, never mind. I failed. Mars house. 
<laughs> How is school, sweetie? What does sign language mean? There were good and bad things that happened. <laughs> what is sign language? That was awesome. I made new, three new friends. Their name is Kayla, Sage, and Angelo. What were the bad things? Well, people were bullying me for my hearing loss. Oh no, the best thing to do is normal. Bullies are executed by themselves. Really? What is she watching? Ew. Later in Caleb's room. Caleb said, Oh, that I learned to get practicing sign language. Okay, wait, Mom. Caleb closed his laptop and they go to bed. I really hope that Amara appreciate me learning for sign language for her. Kayla walks the more and wave at Ew, what the heck? What is that wedding shirt? Hi, Amara. Speak to sign language. Say sign language. You know sign language? Yes, I spent all night learning it for you. Hi, Amara. I'm feeling today is going to be a good day. Say some sign language. Hi, Amara. Say some sign language. She looks really happy now. Well, you guys, you guys can't speak sign language as well. Who else is speaking? Just this one. Weird. Everything is going on until the main groups appreciate them once and for all. Aw, she feels sad. Quit. <laughs> they look happy. Hey, weirdo, what are you doing? Trying to cast a spell? Stop making fun of her for sure. She's definitely... Ooh, he's different than me. But we have different scents for myself. I agreed. I feel really bad at making fun of Nora. Go it, girl! What made you realize that? Well, last time I was thinking about what I said, I realized I was wrong. I made fun of. I made a fun of Amara for being different, when I'm different as well. What are you doing? Are you becoming a weirdo? No, you're becoming a weirdo. No, I'm changing for the better. Sorry, but I don't want to be in your little group anymore. Ugh, whatever. Go talk to your dumb new friends. Let's go. <laughs> Go, go, go. They look angry. Do they look angry? What? They, they didn't even bully them. But, okay. Hey, Amara, I'm really sorry about you. What I did to you. I hope you will forgive me in sign language. Smiles, that's okay. I forgive you. I hope we can be friends. Yes, I like that. Later at the bus stop, Amara didn't know what they were arguing about before, but they felt like she had found a happy ending. She had friends who stood up for her. She made friends that stood up for her. Wait, what was another one? She had friends who stood up for her and made her feel safe. She didn't care about what the other... Um, True of her true friend is what matters to her. Ew, why does the school look weird? Always help someone in need. Besties, their defense. Please show your love, support, and appreciate the Bye, guys. I did subscribe.